Hi, I'm Patrick with the City of Palm Coast Communications team. Today I'm here at Flagler Auditorium, a longtime entertainment hub here in Palm Coast. Today we're going to go inside and see what's new and interesting at the venue. The community didn't have an auditorium. It had no place to gather in 1991. Um, so Flagler Auditorium was the first idea. The high school didn't have an auditorium either. So that was the first idea is to build a high school auditorium. But Dennis Fitzgerald was a school board member. He was also um, as an executive with ITT. Um, and when you get the two of those things together and the other team, because he was quite a good leader, he, they had a vision to build an auditorium that was not only for the school system, but was also for the entire community at large. We are a 5013C nonprofit and we bring the performing arts to Flagler County from outside national groups. We do tributes, we've had headliners, we've had Debbie Reynolds here, we've had Ed Eisner here, we've had Broadway shows, we've had tribute bands, but it's all national tours with people that do this for a living full time. There are only like two high schools in the state of Florida that do what we do where students actually work the shows. All of those shows have writers, and we have to make sure that we have all the equipment here. And who benefits from that? Not only the community, but our children. We have over a thousand kids a month perform here at this Performing Arts Center. We have Flagler Youth Orchestra, we have the band, we have the chorus, we have Matanza Steel Drums comes over once a year. We share the facility with Old Kings Elementary, does a Veterans Day show here. That We have over a hundred events a year. We give scholarships to students, we give money to teachers in the arts that have needs that are above the regular budget of what they get in the school. So when you drive by the Flag Auditorium, remember we're not just a high school auditorium. We're a performing arts center for the community and for our students. For more information on the Flagler Auditorium, visit the link we have in the description. And we'll see you next time on Business Beat.